way he made a plaster cast out of it. Uh, put a little patina on it just to dress it up a little bit and make it last longer. But then I'm taking it from there to the stone. That's alabaster. This is a beautiful brown stone. Once it's polished, you won't believe it. Yet. I modeled from clay first and now I'm built it up in uh, squares on top of each other and now I'm trying to round it off. First time uh, doing a, a, a stone sculpture piece, so I'm you know, learning to work with the materials as I go. It's a circus elephant made out of alabaster. It's soft. It's not as soft as soapstone, um, but it's a a really easy stone to just carve through and sand down. It's my first piece of stone, and I've never done a head before. So. Getting a lot of guidance from George about not thinking of it as eyes and a nose and just shapes. Yeah, making stuff and having it around my house just makes me happy. Just abstract, mountain, outdoor theme probably. I'm pretty much free form. It changes as I go along. Just make methodical cuts and take my time. And 